there was a lot of uh, erosion mm -hmm. that had gone on for 20 years on this creek and nobody ever done anything about it. Man, you're right next to it. I didn't realize you were so close. Once that comes back, it's still going to be hitting up against that too. Yeah. That's why. Well, the way you do this is, is, and if I'm telling you something, you know. That's no, I don't know anything about erosion control, honestly. Um, you can see where water has is it through and wash some dirt down. The problem, instead of putting down filter cloth, you put down weed barrier. Oh, that probably and does. And it doesn't let the water out. Right. So then you get holes in it. Mm -hmm. And I bought material, all, but this hole needs to be dressed mm -hmm. and the side cut back that far or so mm -hmm. and then drape it with filter cloth mm -hmm. i've got i've got filter cloth i've got pins and mm -hmm. you put pins down to hold it in place and then you fill the hole right and then you put sod on top of it and that's the way so you and haven't been digging back here this is just what the water's this, done this is what the water did oh wow and there was a bigger one behind where you are uh -huh. and it's all because if you look down there you'll see that blue stripe that's that that's weed berry i see and so if you dig down there and look, you'll see where the force of the water has rubbed the weed barrier against the rocks and made holes. Mm. And so now if you look down here, you see all that dirt on top right there, uh, on top of the wire baskets? Right. That's washed out of here. So that wasn't there originally. That's what's no, gone that's... from your hole right there yeah. down to there. So I don't know if this is your kind of project. I would say... Like, I know I could just do the, the digging, but because there's so much at stake, I would much rather you get somebody who knows more about this. Do you know anybody? See, we just moved over here and the, finding anybody mm -hmm. to do anything. I, I, I congratulated on finding you. I said, you know, these are people that show up and do the job. That's the best place because what you can say is, you know, I live off right next to the creek and have erosion problems i need a company that can help me with it and then everybody else who is in that group who lives on ponds or rivers around the county can say oh i use this guy he was really good or make sure you stay away from these people that type well, of thing I'll try that. I, and, um, that's and if, a good suggestion that's the best one i have because a lot of people out here they also don't have good online presence well uh, <laughs> and i i apologize that i can't help you out i don't want it to seem like i don't want your business or no, i don't no, want to no, help I you understand. out but and I, I would especially something as serious as that i would turn down the work any day of the week to make sure you well, got somebody I, who actually knew a little bit more than i admire your work ethic and well, thank you. I I'll call that. you when I have something that seems more suitable for what yes, you're doing. Yes, sir. Well, I certainly it's appreciate nice it. to meet you. Very good I to meet you too, you Mr. Brazel. Over here. Absolutely. Anything else you can think of, feel free to give me a shout.